Hey guys, how's it going? SK here, and today we are not on Mind Bolt or Prison or anything else that I've done before. This is new. New stuff. Brand new. Happy, exciting time. We are on Noble SMP. That's right. A new SMP. Now, I know I've been on Mind Bolt, and I'm still not sure if I'm done with it or just doing another one as well. But I've, um,. Uh, I don't know, it's not that I've grown bored of it, but I've grown bored of the community. People just, you know, aren't active. I'm a part of the problem, too. I'm not the most active person. But uh, people just aren't active, and you can't, you can't just go and have fun on the server anymore. Which is a real shame, because it was really fun when it first started, and when everyone was doing things. So, I don't know. But a few of us broke off, and we started this server called Noble SMP. Which is, like, that. Noble SMP. So there you go. I'll probably put it up on the screen or something just to make it easier for you to see. But we started this and I've gone all the way out here to, what is this, like over 1,500 blocks from spawn. Over 1,600, but 1,500 sounds more rounded and well-versed in things. So we're like this far away out and we've done some work. So you see we have this lilac place here. So nice. I love lilacs. They're so pretty. And... We have our amazing house that is not complete yet. It's not into the floor. I can't decide on the floor. I think I might go solid uh, texture like this with the back and forth logs. But I don't know. I can't decide. Okay, a little bit of eating lag there. That's weird. So, uh, yeah, we got that. And then up this side here and upstairs, we have the enchantment room that will eventually be the enchantment room. Right now, it's just an enchantment table and two bookshelves, but we have one at the spawn town, which I'll probably show you tomorrow, or not tomorrow, but in the next episode, because it's a long, long way over there when you just have the stuff that I have. Down there is our mine, and again, here's our place. So I'll quickly run you through most of the stuff that we have, and the other one on the server currently. But yeah, we've got this much redstone. I don't know what that would transfer to. I don't want to do the math in my head right now, because I'll probably get it wrong. Uh, this much iron, almost two stacks. Got loads of wood and some diamonds, which Cody gave us those. Cody's the guy on the server. I'll put his channel in the description. In fact, I'll put every uh, noble member's thing in the description so you can see it. And we have our cobblestone. And you probably saw the cow farm in the beginning. If not, you just weren't paying close enough attention, or I just didn't show it on the frame. But up here is the cow farm, which is a lot easier to access from this side. I don't know. I always go around and do this whole big circuit just to get up there. And it's a lot easier just to go this way. So, I'm talking a little fast. I'm kind of running out of breath here. Let's uh, let's work our way up this. It's not a mountain. You know, I always call these mountains. Like, I'd call that a mountain. Or just this a mountain biome. But in reality, you know, it's just it's extreme hills. They're just really, really large hills. We need mountain biomes in Minecraft. So, yeah, this is our cow farm. We'll probably do for another breed. Oh, yeah, they're happy. They only just want this wheat. Cool. We want to build up lots of cows because we want the full bookshelves. And we're kind of low on food too because uh, we're playing on hard mode currently. Uh, we voted and most people wanted it to be put on normal, so we'll be putting it on normal. But I prefer hard. It's a little more challenging that way and just a little more fun in my opinion. Oh well, I'll still play on normal. It's still a lot of fun. I mean, it's Minecraft. You can't get bored of Minecraft really, except I have plenty of times so I've gotten burnt out. So I have a small little wheat farm over here that I need to harvest soon. But I won't do that right now. The sheep are following me around like crazy. So I have wheat. And a tree farm over here. As you saw in the beginning, just put some saplings down and hope they grow. Nothing really too fancy. But my cousin is also on the server, the Erid Kid, which he doesn't do YouTube, but he's a really good builder. And so he's been allowed onto the server. So this is his base. It's just a cool little minecart thing. Where you get in like this, and you shift to dismount, and here you are in his base. And he'd have the he's got the cow farm above him, so he's constantly got that cow noise going. That can't be very fun, but a little punishment for staying on my land. No, I'm not like that. As long as he wants to stay here, he can stay here, and he has as much fun as he wants. You know what? To be nice, we're going to go grab a water bucket real quick and put it in for him. That'll do. And we'll, we'll harvest everything. So how you get out is this. Just right click there, and shift out. If you're fast enough, you don't take any damage from it, but it wasn't wasn't fast enough that time you know I just couldn't get it so on to uh, some YouTube related talkings I am really considering doing m like not more ads but 
more ads <laughs> in, a, in a different way. I've enabled like some different ads than I normally do. And what I'm going to try to do is I'm going to do like a commercial break like, halfway through the video, you know. In this commercial break, it'll be like maybe a minute, 30 seconds or so. Probably a lot less than that. I don't know why I said a minute. Well, I forgot to put down the water. It'll be like 15 second ads, maybe at the maximum 20. And it, they can be all the way down to like 5 second ads. So they shouldn't be too long at all, and they shouldn't annoy you too much. But they will be ads in the middle of the video, I think. Just, um, I can make a little bit more money. I don't want to sound greedy, but it is nice when you put in all this work to get a little bit of, a little bit of, uh, compensates for what you've, for what you've done. So, I think I'll have those. I don't know. I want your guys' opinion on them. I'm going to try it this episode so you can see what it's like. But if not, if you don't want it, then we'll just go back to the normal ads. But it will be nice to have, I think, and we will make some good money. So, we will run down here so we can see what's going on down in the mine area. Because I've got some ideas down here, okay? This is, um, this is a really ambitious project idea of mine. What I'm going to try to do is I'm going to dig a 3x3 three three tunnel, right? All the way back to the spawn town, which is like well over 2,000 blocks. So that'll be really, really insane. And I'm still not really quite sure why I want to do it, but I think it'll be fun. Uh, it's a ton of digging, absolute tons of digging. I ran into a spawner here, which I broke it because I have another one. But yeah, loads upon loads of digging. Again, I think I'm insane for doing it. It really confuses me as to why I would do it in the first place, but I don't know. I think it'd be a smart idea, and I think it'd be a whole lot of fun to do it as well. So, we will uh, we'll work on that in a later episode, because we don't want to, you know, we don't want to do too much digging right now with the kind of tools we have. We only have iron. We have a diamond pick, but we haven't enchanted that yet, which I need to store my diamonds and stuff that Cody gave me. Lovely, lovely Cody. So, all this stuff is temporary, but a few things that I've done. I have this like light blue wool back in here because it kind of looks like a sky. I know it really doesn't, but it looks a lot better than like a straight wall or glass panes with stone behind it. And if you're wondering why it's two blocks back, so the glass doesn't connect with it, and I think it looks better. So the thing that I'm thinking about doing with this is to brighten it up. As you can see over here, there's a piston facing down which has a torch underneath it just like this. We'll quickly go down there so you can see. Yeah, torch underneath it. And if you didn't know, pistons are considered... I don't know if they're considered transparent or if it's just a bug, but pistons let light through. And the good thing about this is we can use this to put a torch down there. You can kind of see a little few smoke particles rising up. They do the same thing if we did glowstone, which we'll eventually do when we get the resources for it. So, with the torch being able to come out the light, we might be able to take out the majority of these torches through here. And what we could even do, which I'm really hoping, is say, like, for this pattern, do like eight stone brick blocks instead of cobblestone. Do stone brick, like, right there. And have an upside down facing piston in the middle, because I like the texture and the taste. It's also good. And then have, like, glowstone underneath it. And have, like, the entire room completely lit from underneath. And you won't see any, like, torches or any glowstone or anything. I think it'd be really cool. So, that's just a quick thought in my mind. I did try it with furnaces, but they don't let light through. I don't know why I thought they would. I mean, they're completely, you know, opaque, and they don't, they're not transparent blocks at all. I don't know. It's confusing to me. Transparent and opaque. I got most of them down, but I don't know. So, what we're going to be doing today is we're going to make this balcony look really good. We're going to put a wall running in through here, because as you can see, the mountain kind of extends more. We might even have a third layer up there. I think that'll look cool where the mountain kind of naturally rises up right there. So we will put a wall in right here and have that lift up. And I think we can do some really cool stuff with that. So we're going to take a quick commercial break. It's the first time I've ever really said that, but I hope you guys uh, don't mind it too much. I don't know why you'd enjoy it, but if you do, I'm happy for you, I guess. So see you right after that, guys. Be back in a minute. Okay, so I think that probably turned out well. I don't know. We'll see what it's like. But I am ready to start working. Working on this. So, I think I'm going to bring this out one here. You see, we'll go up three. And if we do one, two, three here. And one, two, three here. 
Now I don't really have to follow the spruce pattern, it was just a design I set down in the beginning as a reference point, but it'll probably be somewhere similar to that. So I'm just thinking we'll copy down there, because it looks good down there, I think it would look pretty nice down here too. Except this one, I think we'll take the walls all the way up to the uh, thing up here, so it looks like it's kind of supporting it from below. Here will be pretty easy, you know, just two, one, two, three, and then have this be a two wide, three, and one, two, three, one, two, three. So, it's a lot of, you know, contemplating whether this looks good or not, but I feel like it'll turn out nicely. Who knows? We have to also think about where we're going to put the door in here, a door to come out onto the balcony. I think, actually, if we do something like that, yeah, that doesn't look half bad, actually. One, two, three. And then come over to here. Three, yeah. Yep, yep, yep. I'm liking this already. Okay, we'll put down our cobblestone. It just works as a frame. This oh, we don't need there. The cobblestone just works as a frame to kind of hold everything together. In the look department, you know, none of this is structural. There's really no structural anything in Minecraft. Unless you're playing with a cool mod that adds something like that. If so, tell me about it. it sounds awesome. I love those sort of mods that make it more realistic, most of the time, unless you're playing something really insane. Like, there's this one mod, I think it's called Terra Firmacraft or something. I've seen Etho play it. It's ridiculous. Like, you have thirst and social things and everything, and you have to fill all these needs. It's like Sims, to be honest. But it looks really cool. I don't know. It might not be something I'd get into, but I guess kudos to the guys who can get into that. If you like it, go ahead and like it. You know what I mean? Hopefully you do. Hopefully I'm not just rambling like I always do. Okay. Right here will work. I'm about to flatten out this mountain some. And we'll be doing plenty of uh, landscaping, you know, changing up how everything looks so it's not so grassy around here. Like this will take out just to make it look more like a mountain. Because we, you know, we're not looking for the hill look. Like I was talking about earlier. We're not looking for hills. We're looking for mountains. Because mountains are cool. We love mountains here. On my channel, we love them. They're beautiful. They're mountains. Alright, that's holding that up. It looks good. Except we'll probably just pick that up one more. Yeah, that looks nice. Okay. That's where that goes. See, I'm taking out the stone so it looks like it's actually supporting everything. Instead of just like having stone sit on top of it. I'm really bad at explaining while doing, and I'm really bad at jumping onto cobblestone, it looks like. So, a little bit there. I think we need to put some dirt out so that we can fix that stone block. And we jumped off the edge. We're accomplishing so much today. Falling off of everything. Woo, woo, woo. Okay. I'm just trying to get, like, a design down in my head. Because I think... I don't know. How do we want to do this? Okay. I'm going to need some stone brick stairs. Because this is where it gets kind of a little more confusing to be to be clear. Because we don't want it to just look so blocky. You know, we want to have something to break up the depth and make it look less like Minecraft and more like cool. Although, Minecraft is cool. Don't let anyone ever tell you that Minecraft is not cool. Because it is. It's very cool. Okay, we will... Hopefully that stone will smelt pretty quickly. <clears throat> what to do? If we craft that, then we just need a few more. Let's go take a look at this from outside, even though it's dark and dangerous out on hard mode. I love our little patio out here. We need to work with that some, too. But how does that look? Okay. Inspiration just hit. Yeah, we can have like a third little small room over there it'll probably just be like an observatory of sorts but man that'll look cool and right here we'll have like some stone brick stairs like upside down and regular stone brick stairs and then two glass oh this is gonna be beautiful i've already pictured it in my head you cannot deter me from my course nice 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 okay do i have enough stone yes we do they were happy with us today whoever makes the stone in the minecraft world was happy with what we were doing that's a good sign. So, 
Tell me what you guys think of the floor. I'm thinking just straight, not straight, but complete uh, logs in that crazy pattern that people do. Because I think it looks nice. I've never actually used it. It's a good place for the door. I enjoy that. Okay. If we jump and place at the right time, we can do that. And we'll need to get up for these next ones just to be cautious enough. There and there. Now with a too tall window. Glass panes look good right here. Boop, 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 boop. Ooh, that looks good. I actually think that looks really nice. Yeah, that does look nice. Okay, now we just need to kind of continue with it. It'll have to be different. Like, it'll be cobblestone, you know, after everything else. I might even switch it out with stone or have stone, like, right in front of it. Just to give it more of that supporting look. Unless, like, built into it. More of, like, built under it. Because what's cool is, you know, we have complete freedom with this. We can go wherever we want. But I'm kind of wanting to make it look so that, you know, we didn't build it to live in. We built it to support the mountain because the mountain was maybe falling apart or something crazy like that. Because we have, again, complete, utter way to fall. We have complete control over what we want to do. As long as mobs don't get us. Yeah, I want to do something like that. That's better, because it did look, kind of look like it was just sitting there. Mm, righty. How is this looking to us now? That looks nice. We will copy this pattern over, and we'll get to work on the third thing in the next clip. I will see you when we're ready for that. Wow, just look at that. I think that looks really awesome, to be honest. And over... To the far right, as you can see, we did some things different. I think it looks good, but um, we'll have to see. We'll have to see what you guys think. So let's get a closer view, because from back here you can't really tell the difference too much. But uh, if you look closely, on the left side you can see that there's the cobble there to kind of look like it's supporting more. And on the right, there is the glass, meaning that's completely open, you know? So I think that we can call this... Almost complete. Not quite. You thought I was going to say complete. No, this isn't nearly complete. I just said it was almost complete. It's almost nearly done. Complete. I had an idea. I put these like upside down stairs here as a uh, just as a cover for this. But I think it looks really good. And it fits perfectly to be able to just boop, put a staircase here to go up to this next floor. See, over here, most of this will just be nothing. So, what do you think of a block to use for the roof? I think I'm just going to go cobblestone. But, uh, I'll show you what I'm going to do with that. So, if we go something like this. And we get some slabs. The reason we're doing slabs is there is going to be spawning space for mobs over here. Unless we're going to go through and light it all up. But the way we're going to negate that is just by doing slabs. See, right, right. If we do this... Nothing can spawn on these, but from down here, you won't even really be able to notice too much. And it won't make a big deal whatsoever. So, good saving on the resources, and I think that is always good. Nope. Get back here. We want you, and no. Derp, I'm trying to place you down there. That's better. So I'll just take out a little bit of ceiling here, but that's a project for a few minutes later. So right now, we're going to run and get some spruce wood. So we can fancify the staircase up there. And that's going to be easy. I'm not going to cut. Because I've got things to talk about. You know? I, um... The smarter ones of you will probably realize why I've been gone. Because I am a high schooler. And it is the end of the year. And if you've been in high school or even middle school. You'll know that that is, uh... It's exams time. And exams suck. They're so bad. They... Mm, angerify me. But they're almost over. We've did our we done our first day today, but we only have three days of it, and I've already done four of the finals. Like we did two of them early, so all I have left now is health, gym, and uh, I have health final, gym final, and lit final. So lit is the one I'm most worried about because there are lots of like very specific questions. It's lit slash English, so I don't know. But the reason what this has to pertain with my YouTube is. The exams take a lot of energy to study for, and write on all the notes, and just take a lot of energy out of your day just by worrying about them. So I don't really want to go through, you know, and get home after studying for an hour, 
then go in and try to record a video because I know I'm not going to be energetic enough to make it interesting or have any goal to do anything important. So what this means is that videos are going to slow down for like two more days, which means that this one will be up and then finals will be over. So I'll start having more videos out soon, but I just wanted to explain where I've been. So now that we've got the spruce wood, we can head back. And we will work on the staircase, because staircases are good. I think this is, looks awesome. We need to do something to make the balcony look better. I probably made it too big, but I don't want to move all the walls out now, and it's fine, really. Making too big of a balcony is no big deal. It's a big balcony, not a big deal. Okay, just need to clarify. I might as well just grab this crafting table and run it up with me, because I use it so much to come down here to get it. And I tell you, my voice is getting hoarse. I've been talking. A lot, because, I mean, on the new server, everyone is so active, which is great. It makes me so happy to have active people on the server again. And that means that since they're active, I need to be active. And when I need to be active, I need to talk to people. And when I talk, my voice gets sore. And when my voice gets sore, it sounds all hoarse and bad like this. Plus, I'm going through changes, you know? I've got voice cracks every now and then. Every now and then I get a little voice crack. Don't even flip out about it. It happens. You'll get there. Where you've been there. I don't really know. The thing I wanted to ask you guys is... What, um... Like, what time do you watch my videos? Like, do you get home from school and watch it? Do you watch it whenever it comes out? Do you watch it before you go to bed at night? Because I know a lot of people, like, get on their iPod and watch YouTube videos before they go to sleep. I've never been a huge part of this group. Although, before I had Minecraft, I did a lot. I, uh... I would get on my Kindle, and I'd watch loads of YouTube videos. <laughs> One school night, I even stayed up till 4 in the morning, not realizing that I was still up watching YouTube videos at 4. So that wasn't very good, and that's probably why I have really bad study habits now, is because I've never been good at sleeping. But I sleep when I can. Sleeping is good for you. Don't ever miss out on the sleep. Now that um, I've been in school for a while, I kind of realized that sleep is good and school makes me tired so sometimes I have to fight it not to come home and just lay down on the couch and sleep for a couple hours but I'm sure you've all been there all right where do we want to take this is this about good yeah one more block and we'll be good to go mm -hmm. that's that's right one more okay I want to get a lot done in this video but at the same time I don't want to make it too long so there should be a decent amount of cuts, like not enough to make it obnoxious, but at the same time enough to make it so it doesn't sound like I'm rambling, which I normally do anyway. But I can't really beat that. You know, it's a habit of mine. People, you can't break habits. They're there for a reason. So if we bust out this wall. Yeah, we are perfectly on level. Okay, this I'll do in just a straight log pattern. Not, I keep saying straight. Just the actual log pattern that I showed you guys earlier. So you can get an inkling of what it looks like and see if you like it or not. And if not, then we won't do it down below. But I think we'll keep it up here because it will probably look nice. Hello. Oh, wow, we fell down. Oh, this is nice up here. Okay, I think this is going to make a really awesome area. I really should have actually left the enchantment room from up here. But I think it'll make a cool observatory sort of thing, you know? Not necessarily observatory. It doesn't have a... What do you call those things? Telescope. It doesn't have a telescope. That's what most observatories have, or some big glass bubble. But it has some windows, so we can observe the natural world around us. I said that really, really, like, robotic. We can observe the natural world around us. I think it looks so cool. It's weird, though. Sometimes, like, this corner's darker or whatnot. Oh my gosh, I forgot to mention. I'm on a texture pack. You guys are probably pulling your hair out and thinking how dumb I am. Yep. Yeah. This is my own custom texture pack that I made. I mean, it's based off Faithful. So, the majority of the textures are going to be Faithfuls. Just because I like that texture pack a lot. But, like, stone brick and it's kind of the cobblestone stone, which I still need to refine. But, they are mine. I just kind of, you know, got in Photoshop and put my head down and started to work. And it looks really good. Really, really nice. I think we'll cut it off, like, right here. Probably. Oh, bye, Neon. Okay. 
we do this, we can have something cool, like here. Okay, well, let me bust out this wall a little bit, because it is annoying. I'm just trying to think of what I want to do for the design of the, like, walls, you know? Walls are very important. But I've got an idea in mind. Okay. Let me just look at this for a second. If I go there. Huh. Huh, huh. Okay, I know something I want to try. Let's make some cobblestone stairs, right? I know, we've been working with stone brick stairs all this time, and now we're making cobblestone stairs. But, uh, I think this might look good. I don't know, it'll be interesting, nonetheless, whatever we do with it. But, we mine out this wall, hither, right hither. Let's hope this doesn't bust out, like, the side of the mountain. Good, 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 good. We just got a little bit of dirt, is all. If we do something like this if we were to put in logs facing sideways no that would i think clash with the floor too much but if we try this this might look good with the stairs oh no we'll just have to use the diamond pick for now that won't be bad okay we'll have to seal it up on the outside oh that looks good and we can put we don't have any torches but we could put a torch like right there yeah this looks nice that's a good wall design we'll use it i like it Okay, well, oh man, my air conditioning just came on. Got a cold blast of air wind. Felt good. I do get some lag on the server. I don't know, it's only really when I record. So, I don't know. But it's a good server. It's hosted in the U.S., where obviously I'm from. So, I don't know. I don't know why I'm getting lag, but I don't know. Again, there's not much more I can say about it. I just do not know. Oh, that was perfect. And then planks. But we'll have to think of something to kind of fill in these. Right here, I think if we go stone brick right there, we'll look good. You know what? We'll use a trick. We have some spare stairs. So, we'll do something along the lines of this. I don't think that should connect. And this. No, that connected. Oh boy. Now we have to go through and fix it. Oh, oh it did connect. Oh, lag again. It's like just these odd little spikes of block lag. I'm not sure why it does it. Yeah, I can't really stop it from connecting. What if I go this way, though? Oh, but that kind of defeats the purpose. Okay, we'll just have to make stone brick. Which means we'll probably have to smelt stuff. Oh, joy! Oh, wait, wait, I got something. Good idea, good idea. I just realized. We could... Like, here, if we do it facing upside down, yeah, and then here if we face it normal way, and the normal way, let's see how that looks. Because that should hide the staircase. Yep, and you can't even tell that's stairs. Good news. And this one will have to get actual stone brick. But I think that's going to do it for this episode today, guys. I know we didn't quite complete it, but, you know, we did all we could. We stuck down and... We got to work on this place, and oh my gosh, this looks awesome. Staircases running everywhere. This is sweet. One of my favorite houses that I've built, really. So, before the next episode, we will get all this done. We'll finish the house and do everything. And it should be loads of fun. So, quickly, let's run out here and get a final view at it, because, I don't know. I think it looks awesome from the inside. But we'll have to see from the outside. You don't really know. Oh my gosh, creeper galore out here. We got a knockback one sword that might break at any minute. Oh, hey, 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 what are you doing? You're grouping up. Good lord. Get away. Oh, bye, bye, hillside. Oh, okay. Alright, well, one blew up, but we will check this out now. Yeah, back over here is probably the best viewpoint for it. I think. Probably will do it. Let's eat just a carrot. Do you know carrots only do one and a half now? Oh, yeah. That looks awesome. Oh, that's beautiful. Okay. Well, that's going to do it for this episode, guys. Let's get a quick screenshot for the thumbnail. Wow, that looks cool. And that's all. I'll see you guys next time in episode two. Bye-bye.